Hello everybody, my name is Aaron. This is the Sour Ninja Dual Wield, which allows you to run a desktop graphics card in a laptop at full X16 speeds. And we're gonna show you how we did it. Okay, so here it is, the laptop has internal disabled. I'm holding this card here because of a fray. It's connected to that green HDMI cable which plugs into this TV. And if you look super closely, it says NVIDIA GeForce GT610, which is this graphics card right there, if you can read that. 610, which does not come in a laptop. That would say an M if it was a laptop graphics card. This, my friends, is the real freaking deal. As you just saw, we were running that on a test graphics card, a 610. This is a GTX 980 Ti, and we did not get to run this on that laptop, and we ran into a hurdle. Now the hurdle we can pass, we know that, but our goal here is to figure out if this is actually what people want and if we should pursue this. Let me show you what we're talking about here when I say the Sour Ninja Dual Wield. Obviously we have some brand names here and their trademarks. I'm gonna take this all away and show you what we're actually dealing with with the Sour Ninja Dual Wield. This is what the product looks like. This is a 3D printed model. We're still in testing phase, obviously. This piece is separatable. You can take it apart. Okay, this is the module that plugs into your laptop. This is an MXM plug to plug into your MXM port on your gaming laptop. Not every laptop has an MXM port and you'll need to check yours to make sure you do have one. This can be tricky as some companies did make their own MXM slot. There are resources on the internet to help you figure out if you actually do have an industry standard MXM slot. This particular one is an MXM 3.0. We have looked into other form factors for the MXM slot. From 1.3 to 2.1, we believe that the ports are compatible. From all the research we've done and all the testing we've done, we believe we will be able to bring this to the older laptop generation. This module allows a graphics card to plug in here in a normal X16 PCIe slot, and then auxiliary power coming from a power supply into the ATX power connector. And then obviously you'll have to facilitate power to a higher end card such as this one off of your power supply. The port on the laptop that runs this setup is this one right here. This is a laptop graphics card very underpowered, as most people know. Pull it out of that port, slap our module into that port, and you'll be able to connect up to a desktop graphics card on your Sour Ninja dual wield. Because we're using an MXM platform, we are able to utilize the entire ability of the card at X16 speeds. All of the processing power and also integrated parts of the graphics card. For example, multiple displays. Depending on the length of cable that you end up using to get the MXM module to extend past your laptop physically, you can have Gen 3 speeds. At this short of cable, you can have Gen 3 speeds. We do have extensions to go in here as well, and those can extend and you'll still be within Gen 2. You may be in Gen 3, we haven't been able to test that far. Once again, we ran into a hurdle that we know we can get past we just want to know, is this something the public wants? Is this something we should pursue? And is this something you guys would be interested in? From everyone here at Sour Ninja, thank you for watching. If you are interested in helping out, there's links in the description. If we do have enough interest in this, we're going to try and get it out to the public. We hope to breathe life into your very expensive and now outdated gaming laptops. We'll see you guys next time.